what up how's everybody doing today i'm gonna be camping free camping at this place i believe it's called crinkle rock it's to the it's to the left side of mount rushmore and it's a national forest i believe and there's parking up top and then there's rock climbing down below and a lot of that below camping is just tent only but a lot of people actually camp on the actual parking spot so that's what i'm gonna be doing two weeks from now on the 5th of november i'm actually gonna be heading out to new york um i'm gonna first head to orange county visit friends family and then i'm gonna head over to to boston and from boston i'm gonna go to salem for maybe a day and then after that go to new york for four days so and i'm just gonna try new food check out places just have a great adventure i'm gonna be you know trying i'm gonna be running in the city running at central park a lot of stuff that are, that's been in my bucket list since i was maybe 18 19 or something like that and also um i'm also going to be in april i'm thinking about uh, flying out to portland oregon renting a van from either home depot or u-haul taking the van down on the coast of Oregon and camping at four different spots or three different spots and uh, living in it for four or three days. And you know, it's cheaper than uh, renting like, it's cheaper than me driving out there with this car and putting like two, 3,000 miles on it. So that's what I'm gonna be doing. I think that sounds fun and kind of sketchy. And I'm also hoping to do a bike tour next year uh, of the central coast of California with my friends. So if that's something you wanna see and follow me on, uh, please subscribe, you know, uh, hit the notification button and um, and I'll try to do my best to um, record everything and make great edits for you. But for now, I'm gonna be heading out on the road. It's already 2.34 and it should be a 40, 50 minute drive out there. So I'll see you on the road. Dear friend, change has always been part of traveling. Maybe that's why I love it. I feel as if each new town is a backdrop to a scene. Strangers become familiar faces. Gravel roads to highway curves. Forest to metal. It all makes me smile. I hold my travels dear. And when I miss friends, rain, mountains, city, I can close my eyes and fall back into the tastes smells and laughs. I wish you would have came on one of those long stays away from home. Maybe one day. Can't wait to tell you all about it though. Your friend, Joe. Okay, sorry for the voiceover. My mic kept on, just not working. I gotta get a new one. But this is the entrance to the wrinkled rock. And you could tell it's just a gravel road. And then it leads to a loop. So right here in front, that's actually where most of the people that park their car for the hikes or the rock climbing or just tent camping down there. And then the loops back up here and I stayed over there by that restroom. All right, I'm trying to get get through another way. Jeez, I, I gotta buy some hiking shoes, man. I keep on forgetting, because <sighs> these vans are not made to hike in. All right, I'm gonna go around. It's just, I know it's sketchy, because I know there's mountain lions out here and bears and stuff. Well, I don't know if I'll be able to kill a huge animal, but all right, we're gonna go up this way. Oi, 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 oi! Oh man, 
think I can make it up there. That's pretty steep right there. I don't know if you can tell, but that's, that's steep. So we're down there. Yeah, I'm gonna have to go this way. It seems like there's better grip through here. Jesus. Oh. Huh? You can see that's where. I'm parked that right there, but you can see my car. <sighs> see, now I have to go up there. Oh, let's see if we can make it. Oh, oh. Almost fell to my doom. That's pretty sketchy. Look at that. That fall, man. Jesus. I took some rock climbing skills over here. I started all the way down there. A little pathway, so. Look at that climb I had to do. Whew. Oh, I guess you could have gone this way as well. Looks much easier. But it seems like I always take the hard way. Oh, this is sketchy. It's freaking narrow. Oh, oh shit. Oh, man. Oh, look at that. Look at that drop in there. Oh, shit. It's kind of sketchy. Oh. That's just a crack right there. So I'm gonna try to go up this one right here and get to the top. Whew. Oh, oh Jesus. Oh my goodness. Oh, there's rats in here. See, that was, geez, that's pretty far. And I'm parked right there. You can see the highway passes right through here. Uh, yeah, it's the top right here. Oh, you, you could probably camp right there, man. If you really wanted to, that'd be a cool video. All right, I had my fun up here, and now it's time to go back down. You can tell they're going, they're going this way. I went the back way, which was stupid. <laughs> All right, so I just parked it um, right next to that lady and uh, next to the restroom. So I'll be right there in case I got to go at night. So, and it's kind of in a little, little nook over here. I wasn't gonna park over there, but what if those people leave? Because I think I'm gonna start cooking. I got this flat iron I'm gonna cut up into um, pieces. You know, I'm just gonna throw it in this. I didn't bring my freaking knife, so I have to use a steak knife. But.
smells amazing. And now what I'm gonna do is add the beef. Oh, that's a lot of beef. And this is uh, my hot sauce. It's uh, Cholula. The green chili is made with cactus. There you go. So I'm pour that in there. Get it all spicy. Oh yeah. Hopefully I'm not running to the restroom at night, but if I am, it's right there. And I also got some some bread. Some uh, I think this is non garlic bread. Get everything cleaned up, and I'm gonna eat it in the back of my vehicle because it's getting cold out here, and the wind's starting to wind's starting to howl. All right, definitely gonna enjoy this. Got that. Got my water, got my bread, and yeah, everything else is all packed up right there. Like, all right, let me try this out. Mm. Amazing. Get some of this bread. eating in your car what I'm gonna do eat my food and then set everything up and then I'm just gonna relax you know so let me finish this just like that gone meat was tender the spices were on point I'm just joking no the meat was tender um spicy you know creamy with the coconut milk the bread perfect garlicky fragrant amazing I didn't even use the other lemon because it was that great. Alright, I don't know if you can see me, but it's all set up. Curtains. Got the bubble wrap. Got those up. Yeah, I don't know what else to do, really. You know, it's already getting late. Can't build a fire. One night camping trip. So, and like I said, in April of next year, I'm going to fly out to Portland, Oregon, get a um, get a van, rent one from U-Haul or Home Depot, and then go down the coast of Oregon and camp and live in it for four days. So if that's something you want to see, let me know and subscribe. And also, I'm going to do a bike tour next year um, and just do it with my friends and have an adventure out of it and definitely going to bring the camera along. And there's more things I want to do. There's more things in between, some winter camping. So... Subscribe if you like what you just heard, and um, I'll see you in the morning. What up, what up, what up? Good morning, everybody. So, as you can tell, I'm at my place of residence. I actually left yesterday around 10, 30, or 11. Went to sleep at 7, 7.30, and woke up and just could not go back to sleep. My stomach was killing me. Um, the mattress isn't doing it for me. It, my back was killing me. Something started uh, sniffing the back of my car. I could hear it rummaging through all the bushes. I drove back, uh, driving like 40 down the highway because it was super dark. I was scared to hit like a deer or something. So then I just got home, got some medicine, felt better. Camped out here for like four or five hours, went to sleep. Got up pretty early, like 6 a.m. Went back in the house, got something to eat, and now I'm going to go work out. So, And I definitely need to change this mattress, which I do have one in my room that I've been kind of hesitant to exchange because this one was doing so well now it's done for me but i want to thank my subscribers my future subscribers and all the people that have been watching all my videos thank you so much i really appreciate it i um, hoping to get to that 1000 mile mark so um you know till next time keep the adventure going